John Steen, what do you think people have been talking about over the last week? Oh, I forgot for that. <laughs> I get so nervous, on. I thought you were going to ask me first. <laughs> I just you get relax. so nervous in that moment. I go, who's he going to ask first? And you ask John. Phew. <laughs> it's, not, it's not Sean and the twins. <laughs> I've got to say, it's true. We don't look like twins. We look like finalists in a what's Mika going to look like in 20 years. <laughs> <laughs> John Steve, what do you think people have been talking about over the last week? One of our MPs, uh, Nadine Doris has decided yes. the best way she can get ahead as a politician is to go into the jungle. And eat kangaroo testicles. <laughs> she's decided to enter I'm a Celebrity, Get Me Out of Here, and not spotted that she's an MP, and it's not called I'm an MP, I should probably do some work. <laughs> <laughs> Since taxpayers pay me to do my work. So she's gone out there. She's al I've already seen enough of her. It hasn't even started. <laughs> I've already seen pictures of her Topless. sunbathing in the nude. And her breasts are actually a very good analogy for the coalition because they appear to be a partnership, and yet they're putting as much distance between themselves. <laughs> Would you do it? Yes. No way. I hate spiders. I hate moths. Moths? Moths. moths. <laughs> it's just a black and white off you now. <laughs> you hate moths? It's just a black I and white butterfly. <laughs> I the other day, right, and I saw this massive moth, right, in my bathroom. You saw a moth in your bathroom? Yeah, right? I needed to have a shower and I was too scared to go in. So what I did is I went in with this You're super... You too scared? I went into the bathroom, <laughs> right, with this super strong hairspray. What? <laughs> Seriously. Sprayed and you did this the moth. moth's hair? No. <laughs> I sprayed this moth, shut the door, waited for a minute, saw it on the floor, sprayed it, and then literally oh. crucified it like it was just stuck. <laughs> Poor moth is there, he's blind. He ain't blind, is he blind? Yes, now you feel bad, don't you? <laughs> Basically, you've gone up to a blind person and just <laughs> sprayed hairspray in their face. <laughs> Carol, would you ever go into the jungle? What would it, what would it take? No, I wouldn't go into the jungle. Do you get offered it every year? Yeah. Every Should year I tell they you call? how much they offered me yeah, this yeah, year? Yeah, 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 of course. £250,000. £250,000? And you went, no, I'm not doing it, not no. worth it. Can I go dressed I'll go as tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> It was 250,000. I'm not very good with numbers. 25. <laughs> was in the hundreds. Even if it's, it's 25, I'd eat the whole kangaroo. I'd start at its yeah. feet and just eat... <laughs> I'd eat its fur, its face. I'd, I'd, eat, eat, the, I'd eat the whole kangaroo. <laughs> <laughs> I'd let the kangaroo eat my balls. <laughs> <laughs> the, the Starbucks, the coffee people. <laughs> been a bit naughty. I've been a bit naughty. What have they done? The stalks. What have they done? <laughs> <laughs> what have they done? They've Nothing. been at it, haven't they? They've been, not been paying tax. They don't pay any tax. They manage to sell. Hello. <laughs> 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 oh, no. Get your head round that. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Just. But they've, they've managed to make their books appear that they're losing money, and basically what they do is they, they take the losses from other countries and lump them onto the business here. It's endemic. It's not just the company as well, some of the staff as well. Look. Why did you do that? Earlier this year. Just after a meeting with their accountant. Yeah. <laughs> That's what I was thinking. <laughs> they are one of the few places you can have a coffee and watch women getting their tits out. <laughs> There's a mother's breastfeeding, we think. In my one, where, where I am, there's, like, a, a thing there and there's all bushes on it, and when the breastfeeding mothers come in, you can just peep through the bushes <laughs> like that. It's almost like they're saying, oh, go on, enjoy your coffee. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I just thought, do you know that this is being recorded? <laughs> Sean, what else have the nation been talking about this week? Oh, <laughs> the Tory party conference. Oh, you love it. I was marvelled at the... It, just, it was brilliant, wasn't it? Did you enjoy it? Oh, the part when I came on. Oh, did you? <laughs> yeah. I didn't see that, so I missed that bit. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't really do any research. <laughs> Sorry. Did you, did you, did you, what part were you on? Uh, yeah, I just, you know, I came on and talked about my story in the games and uh, my family came on as well and talked about what it's like to raise a champion. Right. Who did you meet? Uh, Tessa Jowell and um, oh, Jonathan Edwards. Yeah. She's quite, she quite a nice person, actually. 
Tessa Giles Labour, I think. Theresa yeah, May's Tory. Theresa May. Even know she they made a big impression on you, anyway. <laughs> 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 yeah. Are you sure you were at the Tory conference? It, you know, it might it might have been the the Labour. Might be one. Okay, Johnson. What else have the uh, nation been talking about over the last year? Uh, mm. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> it's not a seance, man. <laughs> <laughs> what have the nation been talking about over the last year? <laughs> it just really hurt my head. I see. <laughs> 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 John, what have the nation been talking about over the last year? Uh, well, it can't all be fun, can it? The mm. Levis and the. Uh, <gasps> <laughs> One of his comments was like a Yoda thing. He said, Who should guard the guardians? Not no one. <laughs> Might as well have commissioned Yoda. Who should look after him? Not no one. <laughs> uh, poss possibly someone then? Hmm. <laughs> Just... Ah, hang on. I like the way we're getting to the heart of the issue here. That's 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 all right. <laughs> he might as well have come out on the steps and just said, instead of having go at the press in any way, he should have just said, celebrities, royals, behave yourselves. Yeah. Mm. And that way, he'd have said, we won't even need to report on you. Yeah. None of this would have happened. It was doing the Dalek. I'm really sorry. It was going... And it brought... Is this because you can't do this sort of stuff on British Bake Off? <laughs> you can't, during the judging of a cake, you can't go... <laughs> <laughs> but, mm. It's incredible that he's still... <laughs> Mel's about to make a serious point. There's no way. Brace There's yourselves. No way you can... <laughs> what I want to know is, though, it happened to so many people, this hacking business. How... It must be... But it must be quite easy to do. So how do you hack? someone's call. How do you do it? It's obviously quite easy. My dad used to hack into my calls back in the 1970s by lifting the receiver on the other phone in the house. With his talons. So I'd be... <laughs> <laughs> so I would be in the hall... I'd Let him be... fly off of it. <laughs> <laughs> Your dad's a griffin, yes? He's a griffin. A griffin. I'd be... Oh. On the trim phone in the hall, <laughs> and my I'd be going. Your dad would be on his perch. And, 